Hello and welcome to the integration between uh, Avaya EP Office and Workman HVS um, uh, linking between hotel systems and the IP Office PBX. Uh, what we're going to do now is uh, perform a configuration of the uh, zip trunks and short codes. First of all, we open up the IP Office. This is a slightly slow network here. We open up, you administrate your own password. Uh, we already have the line configured, but I'm going to remove it so you see the configuration. We create new zip line and we set the domain name, and this is the name in my case also disable those ones because they're not used. In this case uh, we have transport and we also changed the port uh, which is 5080 by default on the Workman HVS system. Uh, we also set the URI, add one, and this must be use internal data uh, since otherwise we won't know which uh, room number had has called us. And we're using the default, uh, the group uh, 11 as uh, an example group for in all our cases. Press OK. Uh, and adding a zip trunk might require a reboot, so uh, we'll do that later. We also create some short codes. And in that case, we create uh, star. Let's see what we got. Uh, if we put 60, this will be dialing 1900, which is the uh, wake up extension. So when a uh, hotel guest is pressing star 60, they will get the hotel wake up call, wake up information. Uh, um, we press 61 for the um, cleaning code for the maids. Uh, this is of course something you can uh, decide in conjunction with the um, hotel in itself. We also add one star 62 which is uh, routed to the telephone number 1907 which is uh, an echo extension so that will be the one that we're testing later on to see that we have a communication between the two systems. Press OK and save. Uh, we have some errors, but we don't care about those. And the will require and reboot. So in a short while, the PBX will be rebooting, and it will take a little while. Uh, and meanwhile, I can inform you about uh, our web page, LarsonConsulting.net slash wiki. We have uh, various information. We have a page called All HVS Pages, which contains various information about the different systems and instruction for rooms, etc. Uh, specifically, this one, Workman HVS Installation Checklist, contains a list of all things to be completed. Uh, these are, are contributed of several parts uh, the hotel. US and reseller and uh, from our part. This indicates how the system looks. Various information about the 1900 main extension. Uh, all this documented as well uh, so that you can uh, uh, perform a successful installation. Uh, everything is not up to date here but uh, or this is the page where it will be up to date. Uh, okay, let's see. It's trying to reconnect here. The PBX isn't up and running, but uh, let's see. Okay, there it is. Um, trunks. Oh, I forgot to set the number of channels. It should be four. In this case it's 10. It uh, depends on how you configure the system. And uh, now we will dial the shortcut star 62. Hello. Hello. And as you can hear, 
um, this is the Workman HVS echoing what you say. Um, and that is a solid test to see that it's working. Okay, uh, I think that concludes this tutorial. Thank you very much.